Hey, hey there, elites. How's it going? It's me, your guy, 500k Waddles here. Hope you're doing well. It is indeed again Wednesday. We have done it today on Wednesday, May 13, 2020, the 20W20A snapshot released. This snapshot is a snapshot loaded with advancements, and, and hey, uh, speaking of advancements, we did it. That's right. Thank you all so much. We hit one half of a million subscribers on my YouTube channel, youtube.com slash c slash Waddles Plays. That's pretty good. The support this past year has seriously been crazy. Thank you all so much. We hit 100k less than a year ago, and now we're here. Super elite of you. 500k club merch on the way more on that soon stay tuned and a special as well if you have an idea drop that down in the comments below but today we're gonna break down the 20w20a snapshot if you enjoy the snapshot showcase let me know by dropping a like again thank you all so much for half a million now let's slide into today's snapshot the 20w20a snapshot is actually a pretty small snapshot unless you're into advancements like me if you're into advancements this is a pretty big snapshot in the snapshot a nothing new was added well actually that's not entirely true in today's snapshot there's a brand new clean game mode switcher and lots and lots of new advancements there have also been some technical changes and of course plenty of bug fixes so we need to start with this brand new game mode toggle switcher thing it's clean it is really really nice and this is going to help me out a lot when making videos so when making videos i switch game modes a lot usually i have to type slash game mode you know like survival and then i'm over in survival now and yeah that's pretty cool but as of 20 w 28 that has all changed hold down f3 on your keyboard and then tap f4 and this beautiful menu pops up this menu is the brand new game mode switcher or at least one of the game mode switchers the commands still do definitely work so i'm still holding down f3 if i tap f4 we'll scroll to the next game mode tap it again next game mode tap it again next game mode tap it again it scrolls back when I find the game mode that I want, so say creative mode, all I have to do is let go of F3 and boom, I have switched over to that game mode. Now, F3 and N previously switched you between creative and spectator mode. Because I'm in creative mode, it's going to switch me between creative and spectator mode currently, but let's say I was in maybe, I don't know, adventure mode. We're in adventure mode now. F3 and N will switch me into spectator mode, and then I press it again. I'm back in adventure mode now, actually. So if you use the F3 and N shortcut to switch between spectator and creative mode, first you're going to need to be in creative mode, then you can switch back and forth between that game mode. The F3 and N shortcut now switches you between spectator spectator mode and whatever other game mode you were previously in survival spectator survival spectator y you get the deal I've got to say, this menu right here is so, so nice. This is such a beautiful quality of life change. This is going to make switching between game modes when doing like a tutorial or something so, so much easier. I love it. This is a really nice thing. It's probably something you're never going to see in a normal survival world though, but it is new. It's cool. It's beautiful. And uh, it looks great too. Uh, that's what beautiful means yes <laughs> the 20 w 20 a snapshot brings a lot of new nether related advancements into the game we're gonna go ahead and try and get a bunch of these advancements maybe even all of them right here so i can show you what they are and how you get them advancement number one hidden in depths to get this advancement you'll need to obtain ancient debris advancement number two right there cover me in debris all you need to do is get a full set of netherite gear now i was thinking that we would have to equip that gear i feel like that should be the case equipping the gear should get the advancement but i guess currently just having the gear in your inventory counts the name of the next one is loaded with memes this one is called country load take me home to get this advancement you'll need to use a compass on a lodestone right there beautiful i can almost hear the song playing right now it, it sounds good You'll get the next advancement when you obtain Crying Obsidian. The advancement goes by the name of Who is Cutting Onions? Get it because onions make you cry? Yup, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That's right, the devs were definitely full of puns today. The next advancement requires a little bit of a grind and survival. First, you'll need to get a respawn anchor. Place that anchor down, then use some glowstone on that anchor and charge the thing all the way up to get the advancement that goes by the name of Not Quite Nine Lives. Get it? Nine lives, cats, but this thing has four. Aha. <laughs> to get the this boat has legs advancement, find a strider, put a saddle on that strider, climb on the strider, and then hold a warped fungus on a stick. Now, to be entirely honest, not too sure why I'm not getting this advancement. Maybe we maybe maybe we put it away, put it back. Hmm. <laughs> That's weird. There's an advancement for riding a strider with the warp fungus on a stick, though. Maybe it's because I didn't craft this warp fungus on a stick. Maybe that's it. 
There are actually not one, not two, but three Bastion-related advancements added in the snapshot as well. Advancement number one should be obtained as soon as you enter a Bastion. Uh, there we go. Those were the days. Definitely sounds about right. This Bastion has 100% seen better days. To get the second advancement, you'll have to find a loot chest inside of a Bastion and open it. Once you open it, you get the War Pigs advancement. The advancement is referencing the whole piglins getting mad when you try and take their loot mechanic. And then finally, to get the last advancement, we'll need to find an angry piglin. Hey, look, buddy. Look, you don't like me. But wait, we can calm you down with gold and advancement? Come on. Come on. Advancement? <laughs> uh, okay, 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 okay. All right. Well, we should have gotten an advancement called Oh Shiny for distracting a piglin with gold when that piglin is mad at us. Didn't quite work out, though. And then finally, there is an advancement for going to each and every new Nether update biome. The advancement is called Hot Tourist Destinations. This advancement includes five nether biomes. That includes the absolutely amazing nether waste biome. There have also been some changes to other advancements that were previously in the game in this snapshot. You'll get the bullseye enchantment when you hit the bullseye or the center of a target block from at least 30 blocks away now. You'll get the serious dedication advancement when you obtain a netherite hoe now instead of a diamond hoe. Obtaining Blackstone now counts for the Stone Age advancement. And then finally, to get the 2x2 two two advancement, you know, the advancement for breeding everything, you will need to breed Striders as well. Long story short though, the snapshot is all about advancements, something that I think is a good thing. I feel like with such a massive game, Minecraft has so few advancements, so seeing more definitely makes me happy. The 20w20a snapshot also brings some technical changes and bug fixes. I'll go ahead and leave the changelog down in the description below if you'd like to read about those technical changes. But that actually does it for the 20w20a snapshot. This snapshot was a pretty small snapshot. Again, big thanks to all of you for helping me hit 500,000 subscribers. Half a million, that's crazy. Keep your eyes out for that 500k club merch, it's coming soon, and a special as well. But seriously, if you have a special idea, drop that down below. Uh, that would help me out a lot. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. If you enjoyed today's video, remember to punch like button, subscribe as well. Big shout out to my patrons, Gareth K and Charlie May today. Until tomorrow, stay fresh, elites. Goodbye, everybody.